Hey everybody, Low Wolf Rick here. And it's a Friday afternoon, about 3.30 p.m. As I'm just kind of walking a little bit down the strip here, see if there's anything going on. Here on this uh, pretty much sold out weekend here in Las Vegas. Uh, it's EDC weekend, the Electric Daisy uh, Carnival weekend. Uh, that event is held out at the Las Vegas Motor Speedway. And uh, it's a huge event draws thousands and thousands of people into town here so huge event uh, it's gonna be a busy weekend here in Vegas like I said hotel rooms are pretty much sold out here or they're asking uh, exorbitant prices if you check out our walking for exercise video from this morning uh, you'll hear that uh, the rates it's like the cheapest rooms for a circus circus for uh, Friday night tonight it's like for $288 plus the resort fee and plus the taxes all the way up to the Cosmopolitan over here was $1,250 bucks. so good weekend here in Las Vegas great weather they were expecting a high of 80 degrees but I tell you it's like it actually seems like it might be warmer than this uh, right now here in Vegas so You can tell it's like this area of the strip here is quite a few people are roaming around here today. So while well, it's pretty good, I'm sure the casinos would rather have them inside the property uh, uh, gambling a little bit, so. You see uh, m and bag there, so people are out shopping. Guys carrying some water back to the rooms. Yeah, the EDC, the Electric Daisy uh, Carnival, has become a big event here in Las Vegas every year. Uh, Corporations are getting involved. The sponsorship this year are companies like Allegiant Air and uh, Verizon and Corona uh, Beer is a big sponsor. So uh, even on events like that, it's like the corporations are getting involved. Just waiting for the lights to change here. See that guy with the Eagles jersey on. He's probably here for the game this weekend as Philadelphia Eagles uh, come here into Las Vegas to play the Raiders.
Here next to the uh, mosaic on the strip, it's like they've got this uh, barbecue place back here. Menu looks very good. You can take a look back here. It's like they have a lot of concerts and uh, different things back here. Kind of a smaller venue. I had heard that uh, if you're a country music fan, Lone Star is actually. Uh, uh, going to be here, I think in a couple of weeks, so uh, heard it out on the radio. They give you a size of the, of the building there. Take a look across the way here, it's like uh, at the Polo Towers. some of the residential condos back there. Show you there's some different uh, 
different venues here in Las Vegas that probably a lot of people don't even know exist. Walgreens in there. We did a video about a, I don't know, a month or so ago uh, where we went into one of these strip Walgreens here and kind of looked at prices and everything compared, uh, showed some prices so you could compare them to uh, what the Walgreens on your town uh, actual prices were. Also did a uh, video from here inside this uh, Target store. Probably the smallest Target store that you'll ever see here on the Las Vegas Strip. All right, everybody, so that's going to do it for uh, this video today. Just kind of a quick little walk here on the strip to see all the people out and about here this afternoon. So, well, thank you very much for joining me. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Let you know what we're going on. We post up to about four or five videos a day here, so uh, we're pretty busy here on this channel. To our subscribers, thank you very much. We greatly appreciate your support. All right, everybody, y'all take care. 
and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.